Have you ever wondered why giraffes have such long necks? As we embark on this journey to uncover the secrets of the giraffe, that's perhaps the most perplexing question that crosses our minds. Imagine a creature standing as tall as the trees with a neck that seems to reach for the skies. That's the giraffe for you. Towering above every other terrestrial animal, giraffes command a unique presence in the wild. But it's their long necks, stretching up to six feet in length, that truly set them apart. Now you might be thinking, what's with the long neck? Let's dive into some theories. The most common one is the competing browsers hypothesis. This proposes that giraffes evolved long necks to reach foliage unavailable to other herbivores, gaining a competitive advantage in the wild. But then, there's another theory, the necks for mating hypothesis. It suggests that male giraffes use their long necks in combat, swinging their heads like hammers at opponents. The longer the neck, the harder the hit. And yet some scientists propose that the long neck is a cooling mechanism. With a large surface area exposed to the air, heat dissipates quickly, helping the giraffe stay cool in the African heat. So which theory is correct? Well, it could be one or it could be all. Evolution is a complex process and different pressures likely contributed to the giraffe's long neck. But let's not forget about the giraffe's other unique features. Those long legs that match the neck, the intricate patterns on its coat, and those ossicones, the horn-like structures on its head. Each attribute plays a critical role in the giraffe's survival, making it an incredible example of adaptation. Our quest to understand the giraffe doesn't end here. Its long neck is just the beginning of a much deeper story, a story of survival, adaptation, and evolution. But to truly understand this fascinating creature, we must start at the beginning, the birth of a giraffe. Unlike many animals, giraffes come into this world with a bit of a shock. The birth of a giraffe is nothing short of a spectacle. Picture this. A baby giraffe, or calf as they're known, begins its life with a six-foot fall to the ground. Yes, you heard that right. Six feet. This rather unceremonious entrance is the first hurdle these long-necked newborns must overcome. Now, you might think this is a rough start, but it's all part of nature's grand plan. This tumble helps sever the umbilical cord and kickstarts the calf's breathing. What follows this dramatic entry is no less astounding. Within a matter of hours, the newborn giraffe must rise to its feet and start walking. This might seem like an impossible task for a creature that just experienced the shock of birth, not to mention the fall. But the newborn giraffe, shaky and uncertain, does it with surprising grace. Its long, spindly legs that seemed so ungainly a moment ago now become its pillars of strength. It's a sight that would bring a smile to anyone's face as the calf takes its first tentative steps, teetering, stumbling, but never giving up. But why the rush, you might ask? Well, in the wild, vulnerability can be a death sentence. Predators are always on the lookout for an easy meal, and a newborn giraffe that can't stand or walk is an inviting target. So, this ability to get up and move quickly is not merely impressive. It's a matter of life and death. And so, within a few hours of its birth, the calf is standing, walking, and even running. It's a testament to the sheer tenacity of these magnificent creatures. The newborn giraffe, having faced and overcome its first challenge, is now ready to embark on the journey of life. Surviving the first few hours is a significant achievement for a newborn giraffe, but growing up is an entirely different challenge. As the sun sets on its first day, the calf, standing tall beside its mother, is ready to face whatever comes next. Growing up for a giraffe is not just about getting taller, it's also about learning to survive in the wild. Imagine being born six feet tall and then adding up to an inch every day for the first several months of your life. That's the reality for a baby giraffe. Within their first year, they can reach a staggering height of nearly 12 feet. But it's not all about the height. Growing up as a giraffe is a complex process that requires mastering survival skills, understanding social hierarchy, and developing a specialized diet. As herbivores, giraffes spend the majority of their day eating. Their long necks and tongues, which can extend to over a foot and a half, allow them to reach the delicious leaves and buds that other animals can't. But this height and reach come with a price. Drinking water, for instance, is a cumbersome process that exposes them to predators. This brings us to another crucial aspect of a giraffe's growth, 
understanding their social behavior and the constant threats they face from predators. Giraffes are social animals, forming loose herds of up to 20 individuals. These groups provide safety in numbers, a crucial defensive strategy against predators like lions and hyenas. The young giraffes learn to stick close to the adults, quickly understanding the importance of vigilance and group dynamics in their survival. Unfortunately, growing up tall also means growing up visible. Their towering stature, while beneficial for reaching food and spotting predators from afar, also makes them an easy target. They must learn to use their powerful legs in defense, delivering strong kicks that can deter even the most determined predators. Throughout their growth, giraffes face numerous challenges that test their strength, agility, and adaptability. Every day is a lesson in survival, every interaction a step towards maturity. By the time a giraffe reaches adulthood, it has overcome numerous challenges. But life as an adult giraffe presents its own unique complications. Being one of the tallest animals on Earth is not easy. The adult giraffe, standing at a staggering height of up to 20 feet, truly embodies the phrase, standing head and shoulders above the rest. But this lofty stature is not merely for show, it plays a critical role in their survival. Let's begin with their eating habits. With their long necks, adult giraffes are able to reach the succulent leaves and buds at the top of trees that other herbivores can't. They spend most of their day eating, consuming over 100 pounds of leaves and twigs daily. Their favorite, the acacia tree, despite its thorny defenses. Their long, prehensile tongues, up to 18 inches long, carefully navigate around the thorns to reach the nutritious leaves. Moving on to mating rituals, it's a bit of a spectacle. Males or bulls compete for females or cows by partaking in a ritual known as necking. This involves swinging their necks and headbutting each other. It's a remarkable display of strength and endurance. Within the herd or tower, adult giraffes play a crucial role. They use their height to keep a watchful eye out for predators, alerting the rest of the herd to possible danger. Their powerful kicks, strong enough to kill a lion, make them formidable defenders of their tower. Unfortunately, these majestic creatures face numerous threats. Human encroachment and habitat loss are the main culprits. As forests are cleared for agriculture and human settlement, the giraffe's natural habitats are shrinking. Poaching is another threat, with giraffes hunted for their meat, skin, and tails. Despite these challenges, giraffes continue to display remarkable resilience and adaptability. Conservation efforts are underway to protect these gentle giants and their habitats, but there is still much work to be done. As we can see, the life of a giraffe is a journey filled with growth, survival, and adaptation. Mm. To recap, the life of a giraffe is nothing short of extraordinary. From the moment they are born, these long-necked creatures are thrust into a world that demands resilience. Newborn giraffes enter life with a tumble, falling six feet to the ground, a dramatic entrance that perfectly encapsulates the challenges and triumphs that lie ahead in their journey. As they grow, giraffes face the world with a unique perspective, quite literally. Towering over the savanna, their height is both a blessing and a curse. It allows them to reach the tender leaves at the tops of trees, a food source untouched by other herbivores. Yet this height also makes drinking a precarious act, requiring a spread-legged stance that leaves them vulnerable to predators. And speaking of predators, the life of a giraffe is not without its dangers. Lions, hyenas, and even crocodiles pose a threat. But a giraffe's long legs are not just for reaching high branches. They are powerful weapons, capable of delivering a kick strong enough to deter most threats. As adults, giraffes lead lives that are a testament to their survival skills. They navigate the vast expanse of the African savanna, braving harsh weather conditions, scarcity of food and water, and the constant threat of predators. Their height, while posing challenges, provides them with an exceptional vantage point to spot danger from afar. But it's not all about survival. Giraffes also lead rich social lives, forming loose communities with their peers. These gentle giants are known to exhibit complex social interactions and even display signs of grieving when they lose a fellow giraffe. Reflecting on the life of a giraffe, one cannot help but admire their resilience and adaptability. These tall, graceful creatures have navigated the challenges of their environment with a quiet strength, 
that is truly inspiring. Next time you see a giraffe, whether in a zoo or in the wild, remember the incredible journey that this long-necked creature has embarked on simply to exist.